we're back with our Tate Kent Tuesday. Today we are going to Manning, South Carolina in our 1919 Ford Model T. It's hard to see them, but we have Charlie Toss at the ball of them. As you leave Sumter and head into Manning, you'll see one of Sumter's biggest industrial parks, Continental Tire, which employs over 1,200 people. Agriculture has always been big in this area, and you can see evidence of that in this quaint 20-mile ride. This is really our first trip in this vehicle, any length of time at all. We've driven it around the neighborhood, but this is definitely the farthest we've ever been. The weather in South Carolina is generally pretty mild, even during the winter time, but for this February day, we picked a perfect day to travel. As you head into Clarendon County, you'll go under I-95. On the left, you'll see a town called Alkaloo, which was established in 1885 as a mill town. And now we're heading into Manning, South Carolina, which has a population of 3,200 and was established in 1855. And you know you're getting close whenever you hit Pocatello Swamp. If you have a few extra minutes, make sure you pull over to the side and park and check out the nature trail. The entrance is just up here on the right, but we didn't get very good footage of it because we got kind of excited we were about to pass another vehicle. Okay, it's a front end loader, but we still passed it, eventually. So as we ease on into town, a little bit about McCabe's. Don't let the size of the building fool you. It's just a small block building, and they've been in business for 40-something years, I think. Not real sure. They do whole hog, and they mix the hams and shoulders together. It's vinegar and pepper-based sauce. Leave us a comment what kind of sauce do you like. Vinegar and pepper, straight-up vinegar, ketchup-based, or mustard-based. Okay, we finally made it again. Don't let the size of the building fool you. The food is super, super good. Even got lucky and got a front door parking place. Again, don't let the size of the buffet fool you. You will get a plate full, as you can see here. This thing must have weighed three or four pounds at least. Thankfully, we arrived early, but about 20 minutes after we sat down, the line was out the door.
Okay, so we just got back home from a uh, about a 46, 47 mile round trip to McCabe's Barbecue in Manning, South Carolina. And if you want to go, they're open three days a week, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, 11 to 2. The buffet is 14 and some change plus tax or whatever. Um, I think it's all you can eat, but they give you enough on one plateful. Um, what did you like best? You talking to me? Yeah. The fried, the, <laughs> the fried chicken was delicious. Yeah. It was really good. Jeez. Fried chicken is really good. Um, I really enjoy the barbecue. Uh, it's always been good. Uh, they've been there for about 40 years or so. So, Will, what was your favorite? Barbecue. You liked the barbecue? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, the barbecue was spectacular. And you can't beat the price. And I appreciate uh, Charlie Fawcett and Mr. Tuttle following along with us. And uh, just in case we broke down and my buddy Marty was on standby too. So, But anyway, that's it for a Taste Test Tuesday. And um, we'll see you next time. Make sure you give us a thumbs up, like, and subscribe.